Alright, and welcome back. This is part... Where am I? Part 5 now. Wow. It's like taking me five parts to get this far. And, oh, look at this. Nothing. Huh. But as you saw in the last episode, I got the hammer. Yay. And I got the down thrust. The downward cleave, I think, as Lord Cat calls it. Which means I can do this. Haha. -ha. Sucks to be you. <laughs> so we just go around and I can, like, break boulders now. And if I ever, if I get a game over and I have to go back to the beginning, it will be very, very easy to get back to where I need to go. Ah, come on, really? Come, on, come here. Come here. Doom, there you go. Ah, so. So yeah, I finally watched the uh, new South Park last night. And I have to say, one of the themes running through it, you know, it speaks very, very, uh, really dear and close to my heart, is uh, censorship. And I'm not gonna, I'm gonna not give away too awful much, I hope. But if you think it might be a spoiler, then consider this your warning. So I'm gonna talk a little bit about it. But um, but one of the plots going around in that episode is um, Muhammad. Actually, they're wanting to see Muhammad and all that good stuff. And of course, we all know what happened the last time South Park wanted to show Muhammad uncensored. You know, the whole cartoon wars thing. We saw that. And we, we know what happened there. Just, it's a pain in the ass. You know, and they're, they're worried that Muslims are going to come, they're going to beat down everybody, bomb places, you know, and it's just generally stupid. Honestly, I think they should just show them anyways, and if the Muslims have a problem with it, well, you know, the way they react will just show how big a men they are. Men and women, rather. Because I'm sure it's not just the men who, who would react that way. Doom, 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 doom. So yeah, I mean, I, I mean, that's just one of those things that's been on my mind since last night, when you know, when I actually saw South Park, and oh yeah, Dyra's are a little easier to beat like this. He, <laughs> ooh, 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 red potion, red potion, yay! Hee <laughs> Ah, really, really, really? Okay, come here. There you go. Oh, okay, I wasted. <laughs> Oh, it makes me look like I wasted a life spell for it, but I really, you know, was not meaning to. Oh, look at this. Water of life. Alright. Got the water of life. I can now take that. Go get the fairy spell, because I'm going to need it. Look at this hippity hoppity, hippity hoppity, hippity hoppity. But yeah, censorship is, like, just one of those really big hot buttons with me. <laughs> I don't think censorship should be enforced. I think if you want, if you personally want to censor something, then you have every right to do so. Don't get me wrong. But if you go around and you censor somebody else, then you know that right there is just that that is just not cool. You know, what if somebody else wants to see what you're censoring? Like, like for example, hardcore sex on daytime television. Okay, let's say like Days of Our Lives has a really hardcore sex scene that takes up like you know, ten minutes worth of the showtime. Okay? It just just for sake of argument, I know people are gonna be like, oh man, he's not, he's not, he's not. But yes I am. Oh ah uh, graveyard area. It, 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 come here, come here. Yeah, screw you. Go away, run away, run away. And the king's too, that's fine. And we just fall down. He Boom, boom. This is what... Oh. Wait. I did something wrong, didn't I? See, that's what I get. That's what I get for going on and on and on about censorship and not paying attention to what I'm doing. <laughs> I mean, it's just like, duh. You know? But, you know, we... we yeah, that, 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 that is my fault. So... <clears throat> but, yes. Yeah, so, now you kind of got an idea on how I feel about censorship. Uh... Talk to you. Go in here. I can restore your health. Yeah. While while I'm doing this, I'm also like have checking my cell phone because somebody keeps texting me like two or three different times. Uh, yeah. Yes, I have the water of life. You give that to your grandson or whatever. I'll go see the old man in the back. You know. And and, and look at this. I, I'm popular this time around because I'm getting text messages. 
I mean, it's just, I just wonder, you know, is who it is, oh, oh, oh yeah, I think she's actually ended up sending like three or four on accident, and I have the fairy magic, yay. So, yes, so, so what was I saying, oh yeah, censorship, bad, yeah, forced censorship is bad, so, I know it kind of goes in a little bit of a circle there, but, you know, I want to make sure I get my point across, you know what I'm saying? I mean, if you're going to censor something, censor it on your own time. Don't don't force others to censor things for you. And if you're a parent and you're listening to this and you're watching this, if you don't want your kids seeing something, then, then for Mamoris' sake, be a parent. Keep your kids from watching it, you know. Don't sit there and expect everybody else to parent your children for you. I won't do it, and I certainly wouldn't, would not expect anybody to do that for me as well, so... So yeah, yeah, it's, it's a little, little, another little sort of heavy subject, but you know, it's just one of those that really I feel needs to be addressed more often. Uh, so now we're on our way to the island palace. I don't even know how many minutes it's been. I have not looked at my clock. Oh, oh, oh no, 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 no! Come here, come here! All your experience are belong to me. There you go. Uh, it's been oh wow, not even ten minutes yet. I think I can try. I think I can attempt the island palace right now. What do you think? I think I should do it? Yeah, I think I'll do it. Do -do -do. There we go. Now, what do we have here? Do we have... Oh, yes, red potion. Red potion. Red potion of doom. <laughs> I don't know where... Oh, I don't know why I did the red potion of doom. Doom, do doom, 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 doom. Yeah, this guy. This guy is just... He's too easy. I mean, I could make an ex-girlfriend joke right now, but, you know, I'm, 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 come here. Yeah. There you go. 75 experience points right there. Bam. Oh, and I'm looking to get up to 2,000. I didn't even pay attention to what's next. Huh? Oh, yeah. That's right. I can break blocks. Can't I? Doom, 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 doom. Yep, and we go to the next screen, and there's like this moa here, or whatever. And of course, more of these falling blocks. Hooray! It's funny how they selectively go to whatever floor, you know? It's like, ah, I don't want to stop on this floor, I'll stop on the floor below. You know, it's like, selectively stopping and burning, I guess. Ow, 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 ow! Really? Okay, how did he jump all the way up there, but I can't without jump magic. There you go. 600. I've just got 1,400 more. <laughs> now, sometimes Link can actually jump free without jump magic, but I don't think this is going to be one of them. Yeah, ba doom 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 Iron knuckle, iron knuckle, iron knuckle. Oh, 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 there you go, ha 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 And no up thrust yet, oh, come on, really? Uh, screw it, jump magic, boom, boom. Ah, let go too soon, that was my fault. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, 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 you want to stick your sword in me. Sorry, I, 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 don't, I don't swing that way. I just do not swing that way. Thank you. Oh, hey, look. Oh, yes. <laughs> and you think I'm going to go down there first? No. I'm going to go this way. Because there's a courtyard on this island palace. There's a courtyard and another iron knuckle. Yeah, I, I guess the game is trying to tell you that this is going to be the ball. Oh. You, you hit me. You hit me. Ah! Balls! And, <laughs> and I'm having to start back at the palace again. Well, that's okay, because I have the hammer now. I'm about to drop the hammer and dispense some indiscriminate justice. Yeah. Do 
Yeah. <laughs> so we go back to the island palace again. And we try this one more time. Whoa! Yeah, die, die, die. Oh yeah, and I lose all my experience points. Poor me. Just poor me. Just, just, yes, we. <laughs> uh. Graveyard scene. Yay. It's like, whoop. Whoop, 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 whoop. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Oh, wow, ow. You took my experience point, you jerk. Boom. And here we go, another fairy magic. Look, I'm a fairy. Oh my god, I'm such a fairy now. Ugh. Doom, 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 doom. The good thing is, some of these dealers can be taken out with just one sword for us now. Uh, 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 hey, come here. Come here. There you go. Let me bop off your head. Just... Pfft. Do 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 Whoa! Okay, that was that was dumb move on me there. Just walk into the thing. Yeah, it's just just walk into the enemy there. That's uh, that's nice, isn't it? And here we go, Island Palace once again. Do we get a red potion? No, we get an Iron Knuckle. Screw you, Iron Knuckle. I'm gonna try again for a red potion because I think I need it. Ah, screw it. I'm not fighting you. I'm going on. I'm going on my merry way. Meh. Um, thinking about doing jump magic. Nah. Screw it. Just do this. But thankfully, I don't have to worry about getting that key again. So I can just... Oh, but I still have to go to the courtyard, don't I? So, yeah. Oh, oh! Yeah, life. Give me life or give me death. <sighs> you know, if I knew enough of the cake or death thing from Eddie Izzard, I'd probably be imitating that right now. <laughs> but, um, but actually, Eddie Izzard is somebody... I've heard a little bit of him, and I kind of want to listen to more of him, because he's actually pretty entertaining. And from what I understand, he does, like, no... He, like, doesn't script at all. It's basically, like, watching a comedian during the whole writing process of writing stand-up. So, and, and that is unique as hell in, from where I'm standing, because, you know, you see, like, Bill Ingvall and, and, um, uh, uh, oh, well, so, like, like, uh, Dane Cook and all of them, you see them get up there, and you know that, yeah, it's great, and it seems natural, but if you're someone like me who knows a thing or two about doing comedy, you know that they had to at least, you know, write a little bit beforehand. And who knows, it may probably even in the same case with Eddie Izzard, too, you know, where he has a general idea of what he's going to say, and maybe even writes down a couple of ideas, but the rest is, like, improv, you know? And he's British, and British is cool. Brits are cool. Ow! Come on, come on. Stabby, stabby. Stabby, stabby. Stabby, stabby. Me stabby you. No. Stabs go in one direction. They go away from the hillion and into the iron knuckle. And I don't have enough MP to fill my life. But that's okay. Because I can do... Ooh, that was close. There you go. Down we go. And we got a door there. And I'm just going to go this way first. Because you never know. Oh, hi. How you doing? Hi. And you can't go up that way. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, really? Oh, really? You gonna play that way? Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah! He is gonna play that way. Screw you. Okay. Full magic, full life. Come here. Hold still and let me stab you. You know... You know, that, that reminds me of playing Star Fox 64, <laughs> where Falco would be trying to beat somebody and shoot him down, and he'd be like, Hold still and let me shoot you! I mean, what enemy is really going to do that? They're, gonna, they're probably thinking, No! Uh, yeah. Oh, oh! I, er. I hope everybody is enjoying, like, the uh, 
OC Remix music that I've been putting in its background music. Because uh, it's like about the only thing that will really fit other than playing the same Zelda tracks over and over and over again. I mean, that gets kind of monotonous after a while, so. I mean, if it's getting monotonous for me, I'm sure it's going to be getting monotonous for everybody else, so. There we go. Got another key. Ah, ow! You're shooting me in the back, you fucking coward. There we go, that's how you do it. You face your enemies from the front. Ow. Okay. Yeah, and then watch me. Yeah. Yeah, I say all that and then I come up and I, like, head boink him from behind. So, <laughs> so yeah. So, yeah, so that's, that's the actual thing. It works fine for me, but it does not work fine if you are an AI-controlled enemy. It just doesn't work that way. Yes, I, I know, it's very, very hypocritical. <laughs> but it's a video game. They don't have feelings. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm tempted to actually make that into part of the script for a review or something. Oh, but it's a video game. It doesn't have feelings. And then have a video game console come up and just beat the shit out of me or something. That would be kind of an interesting take. What do you guys think? Do, 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 do. Ah, pff, there you go. And look, another key. And another iron knuckle. Yeah. Ow. Okay. And my controller was committing mute, committing mute, mutiny. Yeah. Yeah. I can't speak. But that's okay. Oh. <gasps> what do we have here? Oh, another one of you. We have another iron knuckle. Jeez. Oh. 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 Come here. Come here. There you go. Oh, blue iron knuckles. Oh, they're so much fun. Because they don't just stab, they throw. And this is like an exercise in dexterity, really. Yeah, there. Oh, oh. Okay, controller, stop committing mutiny. Yep, yep. Ah, okay, that was idiotic of me. Just stand there and and just let him let him hit you in the feet. Yeah, just just there you go. Finally, and I have a raft. That's a small ass raft. I mean, you ever think about that? I mean, the raft here you get it is small, and you're expected to float on that raft to the other side of Hyrule. It's like, no. Just no. Oh, man. What time am I at, anyway? Well, I'm coming up on the 20-minute mark, so... I want to try and keep these videos 20 minutes or less, so... Oh, you. No, 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 no. I'm not fighting you. I don't have time to fight you. I don't even have time to finish this palace, so... I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get to not this elevator but the next elevator over and I'm going to go ahead and end it there and then catch up with you guys on the next video so catch up here go down and right here is where I'll stop for now I will catch you guys in part six but until then this is Gomer the Ranting Thespian signing off